Hello everybody, my name is Sylvia Rimat. And I'm Rhiannon Chaloner and we're both producers for um, You and Your Work, which is a participatory performance festival um, which happens in Bristol um, this year on the 15th and 16th of June. Yeah, it's the ninth instalment of this festival um, and it will take place um, at Arnolfini in Bristol, at the Wellspring Healthy Living Centre and at the Vault Garden Project, which are both located in Baden here, which is um, a community in Bristol. And um, the, the, this year's theme is Here and There, which is, which is basically um, uh, marking our exploration of, um, of how context affects um, performance-based or participatory performance-based work. Um, so um, when we have a panel discussion, which is happening on Saturday um, with guest speakers, you can say who they are. <laughs> okay, the guest speakers will be uh, Ilana Mitchell from Wunderbar Festival, Theron Schmidt from King's College in London and uh, Joshua Sofa, uh, an artist, and also um, Sue Palmer who is one of our commissioned artists and they will be focusing on participatory performance practice in relation to context and location. Okay, so that aside, we've got um, the three commissions. Um, one, one of them actually, um, Sylvia was just mentioning, um, Sue Palmer's project, um, which she's doing with um, uh, Geoff Winterhart and Simon Roberts, um, is the 100-year-old band, which um, involves 10 participants from all over Bristol, um, aged between 0 and 100, so one from each decade, um, who are producing a song, um, which they will be performing at both Wellspring and Arnolfini. And I'm particularly excited about the fact they've got a theremin player. So um, yeah, so there's that. Um, and then we've got um, five additional performance works. Um, one of them being an international project from Australia, which, which you is, can talk uh, about. <laughs> which is called Kansas. Thank you, Rihanna. Yeah. Um, by Malcolm Whitaker and Georgie Meager, and it will take place in an elevator, uh, and is for three audience members at a time. Okay, and um, okay, so. One of the most important things about our festival, which we haven't mentioned, is it's totally free, um, which we think is really important because it enables you know more people to come to see the work. Uh, one of our uh, key aims is to reach wider audiences and to uh, yeah engage audiences who normally wouldn't come and see this type of work, which is a shame because we believe that this kind of work is uh, is a work that uh, many many people can enjoy. Yes. So um, so I suppose we should just cut to the reason why we're making this video and it's basically because um, one of our funders has gone into administration um, and so we are minus £3,500. Which is for us uh, a really big gap and almost impossible uh, to bear. So. Um, so uh, our only chance we saw in uh, yeah in this refund as we help that you could uh, all our friends and supporters could uh, step in and uh, donate a, a little bit of money uh, so we can uh, yeah make this performance festival happen because there is a lot of passion and hard work going into this project so uh, it is really important that there is a level of. Um, yeah, financial uh, support that is secured. And as you probably know, I don't know if you, you're lis you who are listening to, to us speak are, are creative people as well. You know, a huge amount of effort goes into to making work and producing work. Um, and so we want to make sure that everybody is, 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 is adequately um, paid. paid. <laughs> and uh, as a token of uh, gratitude, if you, if you decide to give us some money, which we... Uh, yeah, would be very yeah. happy. Even about. a five is mm -hmm. a five, a five is, is fine. fine. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Uh, so um, we want to give you something back as a thank you. So, for instance, um, we will send out uh, badges uh, that are related to one of our commission projects, Iconic Kid by Dane Watkins, which we haven't had time <laughs> really to talk about. Um, up to uh, securing tickets uh, for the festival. That whole festival, as Rhiannon said, is free, but some of the performance have, have a very limited capacity, so if you if you decide to give a certain amount of money, we make sure you get into all the performances you want to see. And um, if you're very generous, um, yeah, we would love to uh, share a glass of champagne with you in the Arnolfini bar, uh, which I particularly <laughs> am looking forward to. Um, yeah, so um, I think that's it, that's isn't it? it? Yeah, okay. Thank you very so much. Thanks for listening.